Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another video. So I put the chandelier hook up this morning. I've hung the chandelier on a very long chain, so I have access to it sort of near the floor. So I'm not up and down a stepladder to put all of these glass beads back on. But I'm not gonna film any of the glass beading today. I'll probably film some on the weekend or early next week, just because I wouldn't have enough time today to do all of it and I've got to keep an eye on Rick because he is in the basket on the telehandler or on the manito and I've got to keep adjusting it for him because he's painting the staircase windows today. So we're going to go back downstairs now, keep an eye on Rick and just make sure he's got to be where he's got to be. So let's crack on. Looking good, Rick. The windows don't look too bad either, mate. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, today we're at the uh, top of the staircase. Mm -hmm. uh, we've managed to do the top three windows, which uh, I think they were about what was it, eight metres high or something. They're but quite in, high. Uh, they were tasked steady man Manitou? Manitou? Manitou or telehandler. Okay. Yeah. Telehandler. So it's really nice and secure in this cage. It is, yeah. Um, and now we're just tackling the big... Uh, the big windows below it. They look they look really good from down there, yeah. Rick. They look fantastic, mate. Um, this this telehandler or manito can literally hold tons at this height. Well, I'll put so... a bit of weight on. But, uh... <laughs> <laughs> no, but just to say that it is quite safe. Yeah, Unlike really a cherry picker, which can only sort of support about 250 kilograms. I think they're a bit more bouncier as well. Yeah, aren't they? they this are. This is bit... really sturdy. It this. is sturdy. The cage is really good as well. It is, yeah. Yeah. So we're Fantastic. all good up here. Doing a great job, mate. Thanks, you. I look forward to seeing them finish, mate. Yeah, and it's Friday, so I've got to get them finished. <laughs>
It's looking good, Michael. It is. It's looking, it's looking like a terrace again. Yep. Uh, it's starting to feel like Groundhog Day. Yeah, it will. It will every, do a bit. Every day the same. Imagine what I went through laying the tiles in the kitchen at the convent. Oh, that was imagine. just never ending. Tiling, I'm not into tiling, but I suppose this is a bit like tiling. Well, this is probably not as not as easy though, because I don't know. It's just a different sort of method with the tiles. At least there's some sort of like quick results. You know what I mean? You're laying something that's different. Yeah. Here you're just filling joints, so it's not as not as fun. Um, not saying tiling's fun. Yeah. I keep changing my mind about the colour, but actually, once you once you look at it, once the sand goes on, it all looks the same colour anyway. Yeah. So. Yeah. But um, I'm experimenting with adding a, a dash of yellow to it now, just to right, make okay. it more creamy. Yep. And, um, but obviously, each pot is mixed individually, so actually. The colour changes so gradually as you go across, mm -hmm. it doesn't, you don't know to see. Well, it looks really good from here. Yeah. You can see everyone. It's quite like a yellow sandy colour, but that's because there's sand that's, on top the of it. The sand's wet at the minute. Um, you see when the sand dries out, it goes lighter. Yeah, it goes a lot lighter. But and yeah. I mean, this colour was almost like, to look at the, the grout once it had been laid, it was almost like a, a lavendery pink colour. Yeah. And once the sand goes on. Yeah, it really it changes like the colour. Sort of brown granite colour. So. Yeah. Well, I'll let you crack on a bit more. Yeah. Doing a good job. Yeah, doing my best. That's all you can do in life. Yeah, or your worst. <laughs> Depends how you look at life. Yeah. Them windows look amazing, mate. You've done a fantastic job. I'd say it's took us all day. Yep. But um, they are very big windows. They are very big windows, yeah. We have yep. to go up two or three times on the monitor. Yep. Uh, but we have managed to get them done. You have done a great job, mate. They look really good. Thank you. Um, they just need a second coat. Definitely going to need probably to next call. week, depending on the weather. Those doors they need they look okay on camera, but there's a few like dark patches where the, the paint soaked in quite the a bottom. lot. Yeah, it always seems to be down near yeah. the bottom of the doors yeah. or the windows, and yeah. Um, but we've got a lot more windows to do, mate. That's all right, and a lot more shutters to take. Plenty off. of paint, plenty of brushes. <laughs> We're yeah. all right, yeah. We've got plenty of paint. Um, yeah, they look really good, mate. I really, really appreciate your help. It's been a good week. We've yeah. got uh, a lot done. I can't remember how many we've got done now. 20? Lost, lost 20? count. I don't know. It's a few. <laughs> yeah. All right, <laughs> well, then, mate. Well. Yeah, have a nice weekend, mate. You too. Um, beer o'clock now. Beer o'clock. Beer o'clock on a Friday. Yeah, all right, mate. I'll okay. see you later. See you later.